Very emotional. Excuse me, my dear friends, there are plenty of things in the newspaper. Please read and get to down to the Friends, as long as you don't disagree with you. I'm not here to answer your question, sir. Thank you. You're not worth talking to, you totally opposed. So, I am not worth talking to you. Are you a Christian? If I am, would you I said, are you a I said, if I am, would you I said, no, that's not an answer. I don't have to worry about that. You've always been like that. And you will always be like that. Because you're scared. So, I'm asking you a question. Listen to him. I don't answer your question because it's already a 5% Right, so let's say you won't even tell me who you are. Let's say, let's say my name. What's your Andrew. name? Andrew. My name's John. John, that's you, John. Right. And so, are you Andrew, born again John. Christian or not? I'm not right. Are you Muslim? I am a Muslim. Oh, right. So you follow the devil then? No. Oh, yes, you do. So, can you give me, if you Don't prove to me that I follow the devil, that Mohammed said so was a devil. Well, who's the moon god? Who's the moon god? Mohammed. Let me finish my question. Allah, the moon god. The moon god. If you can prove to me that, that it's from Satan, I don't know which one's then this. I will leave this. Right, right, good. I can prove it straight away. ISIS is proof. They are not Muhammad or Allah. Yes, they are. They do it all in the name of our Muhammad. They behead you. Boom. That's it. You're dead. It's there. Where's your proof? From the book. There are facts and figures that prove that ISIS murders people every day. Right. Last. Last. That. That. So you want to ISIS is over. No Make a statement and run away. They're free to do that. Is this religion to worship? Is what does it matter in terms of why does it matter about the, the, the Greeks or the, what, what was that? You have two different points about embryology. Like, what does it matter? What you just about if the Quran did it, like, or if the Greeks did it, or if is, someone did it, when we, it really matter? When, when we present something from the Quran, we say this is remarkable, and someone says this is not remarkable, you know, you can just agree or to disagree. Mm -hmm. But what I'm saying is, the moment you say, look, I've studied this subject, because I've studied ancient Greeks, and I don't find it remarkable, then I will say, look, but I studied it too, and I didn't find that the Greeks knew this. So that was the point here. When I talk about many things, for example, you know how the Quran talks about lots of things, right? The Quran describes human beings' psyche, like how people, when they are in a state of despair, for example, say you're on a boat or a ship, and the waves come all over you, all around you, and it's sinking, and you're about to die, you don't then appeal to the bottle and say, oh, bottle, help me. Oh, my bike, help me out of this trouble. Oh, camera, help me out of this trouble. You don't call upon these things which you know they have no power to help you. Can I finish my point, right? Oh, At this very minute, what happens is people sincerely call upon the one true creator of everything and say, Oh God, no, no, no I just, this is what the Quran says, right? Yeah. So if, if you find people are in a situation and then say they turn up, turn to teenage mutant ninja turtles, oh save me, or Superman, or Batman, whoever they are, you will find if you ask these people who are in this kind of 
of course. Unfortunately, in this problem, and then they were then safe, safe later, they would not turn to this kind of thing. So what we're saying is, within our own self, deep inside us, what we call the fitra, which is the natural inclination and disposition to turn to the one who created all of us, and the Quran talks about this. I, I agree that you one wants to turn to something that goes higher than us. I think it's just because it's because because you live you born this earth, and first like, one of the biggest questions is what is the meaning of life? And and you're born this earth and think, and it's, I would love to, I'm an atheist, but I would love to have this kind of idea as there's a God, you know, with like some sort of all powerful being who uh, who like enables us to have free will, but there's something more to life than this, you know, than this. And that's a lovely thought, and you know, probably when you're dying and you think, oh God, you know, and I think that's a really and lovely thought. And yeah, and 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 why would you because say subject, because it's, it's subjective? Why it is subjective. subjective. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's subjective. But you believe I, I it. Like one believes it. experience is subjective. Yeah. I mean, no, no. That concept is subjective. Yeah, but I mean, one believes it. I mean, what? No. If he or she or it, or whoever this may be, this strange person, everything you said so far, here, floating down here, but everything now, you're saying but, and, and actually landed, but you, what do you believe But you it? cannot say, you cannot say, you cannot say, I have proof right now that there is a God. You cannot say, that is my objective. He's going to explain to you why what we're saying makes more sense rationally. No, no, no. I'm not saying it's. No, I'm not saying what yeah. you believe in well, the Quran or the Bible is, is good sense. or bad or whatever. But there isn't that you, proof at the moment that why? someone's come down and landed here. Do you believe right the universe came into existence? I believe that science may come into existence. So, do you, so you believe, believe the universe science? came into existence? Yes, of course. We're all standing here, from? aren't we? He's a pharmacist. He's well, 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 what causes well, him that? Nature. I'm not sure he is. Nature. I just think nature. nature. Yeah, nature. Let's we, we call it God. What, see, see, that's, 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 that, that's where I think that, yeah. that's where I think. Do you believe in something? Is. Yes, so, so I, I'm saying I believe. Believe in science. I believe in science. So you believe in science. science. So you're not atheist. Believe so I believe in science. science. Don't believe in science. I believe in science. Don't believe in science. I believe in science. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. But don't I, believe in science. I don't think I don't attribute it to a god. So I believe in science, and that's but where I draw the line. It says when you die, you will go up to join those people. My sister, I think you've misunderstood what you're saying. That's why. 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 That's I don't believe science. There's someone called Jesus. There's someone called Mohammed. There's, 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 there's someone called the Big Cat. Wherever they be. I personally don't believe science. I believe science. 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 So we all agree that science. Let's explain this. Explain that. Explain why the grass grows. Explain why my hair grows. I'm saying I believe in science. I'm saying I don't believe that something is there behind science. And I completely agree with you. There's a boat and all the waves come and you think, oh God, oh God, because it's, it's nice, it's, it's comforting to think that, say you're so poor, and like, and, and, and it's like, um, what's it, come on, religion is the opium of the masses, it's nice, while yeah, so you're slaving away, that there is a God, and in heaven, you have, you know, you have everything, and it'll be perfect, and, and, and you'll be rewarded well, for this well, life, it's hell. oil well, in life, you will, but, but, but that, I think that, that's what religion is, it gives you the happiness, you see, when, when and you I say, think that, when you, you know, say, when you say, we look up to something in Christ. Look, if someone doesn't believe in God, it is irrational to look up to something higher at the moment of distress. It's irrational. Because if God you, is rational. Not irrational. If you, yes. yeah. So why would someone at that very point in need suspend their rationality? It's because there's something deep inside which tells them that yes, there is something out there, something out there who is able to, well, you know, was able to help and intervene to save my life. Okay? See, I think that's very different. So you say if there's something in us, and that disposition, disposition may be, but I think it's just a yearning, a want for there to be something bigger. So, why should so, it be so, for an atheist? So, so that's, that, that, that's no, why. In human nature, there is a want in, 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 to be in a high life. It's okay. like you're, you're saying you've got the best job, you get the best girlfriend, you get the best car, you get all those material things. People yeah, want to think there's something more than this, there's something more they put on this earth for, just solely to earn more money, or solely to get better clothes, or solely to earn and if that belief is, if that belief is, that's that's a religion, and it's called uh, Christianity or Judaism or Islam or whatever, then that's great. That's what one person believes in, and if that what makes that one person happy, then it makes them happy. If the other person, John, John, yeah, John. if the other person wants to, the point, your cats, the point, yeah. the point I was making about, if you're an atheist. I don't. Have, the flying spaghetti monster. If you, I believe the flying saucers are going to come down. If someone is an atheist who doesn't believe in Santa Claus, 
Who doesn't believe in Superman or Batman? Let's take these super comic heroes, comic superheroes, right? So at the point when death is impending on the under, do you think they would call to Superman? Think about it. They would not say. I, I, I'm completely in agreement with you, but I, but I differ. So I, I differ in terms of the belief that you think that there's, there's a, it's a decision to believe in God. That must mean there is a God. I think it's a, I think it's a it's like it's yearning to believe there is something. I, and I don't believe. With all respect, with all, with all respect, I said one of the answers many things. It also talks about the human psyche, and this is where I introduce moving away from science to the human psychological behavior. This behavior is seen at the point of need and distress when a human being experiences this experience. If you're not in a distress like this, an atheist would never turn up to God and say help you. It's only when the Quran says these things come to over overcoming them and they're about to die, they call upon him sincerely. And when they're saved, this is a it wasn't God. They forget. They forget. Yeah. 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 Really okay. sorry, we've got to go. We're going to be like, really good discussion. You. Really good discussion. And it's, you know what's great? It's basically after what happened last night with all your trustees and stuff like that. <laughs> the people who come to this place <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. and they can have a chat <laughs> about a religion or the cats or whatever and they can do that without basically wanting to smash each other over the heads with this bottle or that bike. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, discussion. have you two read the Quran before? No. no. You should do well, that. Well, I, 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 I've been told that you can't read in English. No, you can. <laughs> well, I've been told. That's, like, that's incorrect. You can't. Like, people say that there's well, translation. Well, 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 you know, you, you come here, need to read. I'm like, oh, I'm a bit challenged. Is it a Christian that said that? If you come in next week, I will give you two a copy. Can you come tomorrow next week? Maybe. I'm not in the country next week because I'm afraid I can't. We're going away. Online. Look up online. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll give it a look. Peter, see him. I'm asking Jesus. How many people? Peter, Peter him, and Jesus. How many? Three people. Three. The way you put it. But let's look at the verse. Right, right. Three, right? Three. I was talking about the. Um, we're trying to do this, yes. No. Yeah. <laughs> Peter, oh, he no, said no. to Jesus, what shall this man do? Peter said, what shall this man do? Jesus said unto him, and to Peter, oh. if I win that he tell it till I come, what is thou to thee? Follow thou me. Yeah. Right. This is the disciple. Oh, 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 why did you skip that there? This is the disciple which testify of these things and wrote these things. And we know that his testimony is true. Okay. His disciple wrote these things. But, but, no, you've taken the context. Is it the context? No, the, con the, the, con no, the context is. The, the, context. The, the context of that, the bit you quoted first, is Jesus, Peter's asking Jesus what is going to happen to John. And Jesus says to John. No, asking to John, not say John. No, he does. No. Let's see the context. Read the context. The context. John, read the context. Listen. Yeah. John, John is after Jesus. Now read the context. Yes or no? John looks mad after Jesus. But was he not a disciple? No. He was a disciple of Jesus. Ah. Who, is who, is who is his disciple? Yes. 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 Let me show you. Don't worry. John was his disciple, wasn't he? No. John was He wasn't. No. He's talking about the disciple who Jesus loved. Exactly. And then he's going to Who is? Who is? No, that's Matthew. Why have you gone to see, John? The context. No, the context. No, no, John. To to John. To How can you give context of John going to Matthew? You have to go to John. This is it. It's not. John was. John's the only one. Listen, listen, listen. You're giving me a headache already. John, Luke, Mark, yes. Paul. All yes. of them Matthew. after Jesus. They wrote after Jesus. Yes. yes or no? Okay, I yeah. agree then. After Jesus. Yes. Why yeah. you tell me John wrote this? Right. John, John Peter yeah. asked him, Lord, what shall this man do? Jesus said, I will take care till I come. When I come, leave him. Meaning, if he's alive till I come, why does it matter? Who is this really? disciple? The one who Jesus loved. Yeah, who is? That's John. That's John. John is after Jesus. Well, he's referred to as the one Jesus no. loved.
Jesus loves only one. Only one. Oh, Peter. No. Oh, Mary. Here. And as they came down from the mountain, Jesus turned them saying, Tend the vision to no man until the Son of Man be risen again from the dead. Jesus loved the Son of Man. What? Only him. Who's the son of man? Ah, he is. Who's the oh, son of man? Now, where are you going to go now? Yeah. Can I, John. Can I, can I go to John 13? Can you go to John 13? Yeah. Can you go to John 13? Yeah. Can you go, go to John 13? Yeah. John 13. There we go. From all the disciples, the one Jesus loved was sitting there. No, Jesus loved no the disciples. No, he didn't, he didn't love them at all. No, no, about them, no. So why did he choose them? Only one. So the other ones, they followed him, but he never loved them. Yeah, love, love you, friendly, everything, but love. Yeah, but he loved the most. Jesus died man. for him only. The one who Jesus loved is sitting and leaning on the breast of Jesus. But who is that person? Ah, who is that person? Yeah. Who is that person? So it has to be one of the disciples. Right? Yeah. Only one. Only one. Only he one. has to be amongst the disciples. Yeah. For God so loved the world. Stop. Oh. <laughs> God loved the world. We talk about Jesus there. No. God loved the world. He was so great he could do this. He couldn't do it. How is that verse related to what we just spoke? Is the same. Is the same. Do you what, what you read is one of the beloved of Jesus from the disciples, from the group of disciples, the one Jesus loved. How is John 3.16 to do yeah. with that? Man. Love the world. To who he is love? This is the question. To who he is love? He here says God loved the world. The whole no. world. That's what he says. No. Who is the world? Man. Listen. 15 9, what's that? I, I don't get how you what's get it? one text. As the Father has loved me. He says world, world, world. Is Jesus what's the world? world? No. So what are you saying here? Man. As the Father has loved me. Who's me? Ah, me is one or more than one. It's one. Exactly. Who is me? That's my question. Yeah. yeah. Who is me? Let me show you. Where are you going now? Oh, he's going all the time. No, no, it's not like this. It's one, it's one verse, three and a half verse, three and a half verse. Nah. You can prove anything with this. I can prove everything. Wait. You can prove We're talking about love. Yeah, the disciple. I mean, you can prove anything. We're talking about the disciple love Jesus and the disciple God loves you. Right? Love. Love, 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 no, no, love. No, no, you can't yes or no? No, hold on a second. Jesus. Follow, love. Sorry, let disciple. me finish. Let me finish. Follow this. Jesus had disciples. Yeah. Yeah. That verse says the one Jesus loved from the and disciples, God. the best, he loved the best, Only one. was there. But the verse you show me, 316, it talks about God loving the whole world. Yeah. That's different. Jesus loved, loved him too. One person, the whole world. No. No. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Love many men. Yes. Gay, they love. No. Lesbian, they love. No, no, this is Jesus loving the disciples. He loves one. What do you love? Love. He has affection. The most affectionate. You can love your mother. You can love your siblings. You can love your kids. You love them all. But Jesus loves only one person. No, he loved them all, but he loved this person the best. Only one? Yeah. Who said, love me? Thank <laughs> you.
All I wanted was an admission, and he gave it. He rented it for the whole You know Keith Ward, he's still sticking by his point, No, no, and all I wanted... Yeah, we never use him as, a, as evidence, by the way. I suppose, yeah. yeah. But he's still sticking by his point. What, what I was presented with last week was, was the Keith Moore argument, so I just went away... I didn't say Keith Moore argument, you keep on misrepresenting. I said, Keith Moore has written an embryology textbook. I was not using him to support my case whatsoever. I said, the, there are there are academic textbooks written by, for example, Keith Moore, TV and Pushup. I give you two other names that I give you now. Langman's embryology textbook. Right, so, 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 so I asked what do you rely on? I didn't say you rely on anything. Okay. So you you keep on misrepresenting. So said, no, all you didn't have. Well, no, he's explained to you. Yeah. 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 But then I said, okay, I'll come back next week. I'll find out a bit about okay. it. I just raised a few okay. questions. Okay. okay, just to just to clarify what you said about yeah. Keith Moore. Yeah. Keith Moore was invited by a Sheikh Azindani. His name is Azindani. Sheikh Azindani performed a project called the Commission for Scientific Science in the Quran and Sunnah, inviting. Experts from all around the world, non Muslims, all around the world who are experts in their field. By that time, Keith Moore was one of the, if not the leading authority on embryology based on his texts and his works. If you look at his credentials, if you look at his credentials, all these things are his one, right? Right. So he was indeed an expert. So he was invited, as well as other people who were invited. Lots of people, oceanographers, you know, geographers, lots of different people. So look, you come along. So let's talk about one, just about this point about everything. Not embryology, on the science in the Quran. Lots of things about the science. So everyone would say to the other people, they are looking presented papers. They're all available online. There is a book. There is an option called. Um, this is a. This is the truth. Uh, I'll have. This is the truth, and it has video of those people in the conferences, and you can see them. But what's happened is this. This had a serious impact in the world. Why? Experts are presenting their case and saying, Quran and Islam says remarkable things about science. So the people who are naturally not Muslims, are atheists, they didn't quite like the idea, oh, how can they say that? Because it's not driving people to study about Islam or look into Islam or perhaps even become a Muslim. So a lot of people come up with this and then one guy wrote a journal, uh, uh, an article in the uh, Wall Street Journal thing saying, look, actually these people were paid loads amount of money and they cannot be trusted because they have lost their all their integrity. And were they paid? Yeah. And were they paid? If you invite, even today, if you invite people to come to a conference and present something to me, we give honorarium. They get paid. So there's nothing wrong with getting paid for an academic. What they were asked, what they were asked, they could be paid by Tony Blair or, or Margaret Thatcher or Theresa May, it doesn't matter. You are saying, oh, because it was paid by Saudi Arabia, no. This committee, this committee had members from various countries. If you were to study the members of this committee, and you will see there are lots of different sponsors from all around the world who contributed to sponsor this project. So they came and they had their honorarium. There's nothing wrong with that. But the moment you say, oh, this is linked with Osama bin Laden, as if Osama bin Laden was a terrorist then. At that time, there was no 9-11. It was pre that. He was a very, very, very rich individual who sponsored lots of things. And this is one of his sponsored works. You will be at a guilty person by associating, you know, retrospectively, oh, this is sponsored by a terrorist, you know. This what we're to do is establish the admissibility of that piece of evidence. What evidence? We are not giving you any evidence. What we're saying is, these were presented. What you haven't done is this. You haven't looked into their research papers, which they presented in an academic fashion, and they had all the references from classical, classical, classical Islamic works, from classical dictionaries, dictionaries which are hundreds of years older than today. Why? They went to say, look, the Quran says this, is this a new meaning? No. Let's go back to how the Quran was understood then, four thousand years ago, or eight hundred years ago. Uh, wait, 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 wait! I want to, I want to show, I want to demonstrate to you that you came up with something you haven't even understood what you were talking about.
Oh, I'm not waffling. I'm giving you the correct picture. Did you know one of this before? Oh, so there was a point of talking. Sorry, nice talking. Because you're not listening. Okay. So you're not my hands. Thank you. Thank you. No, no. Did you not get that from NHS? Yes, 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 Makes sense. You sound like somebody I know. Uh, she's a wonderful person. Kim Jong May, people call me Teresa. Where is she? I too. Spanish Prime Minister. We can do it. We can do it.